Arctic winds blowing across the U.S. are sending temperatures plummeting, leaving cities in the storm's path racing to prepare emergency services. It's uh, cold, it's uh, windy, it's a lot of snow. With temperatures falling nearly 50 degrees in 24 hours, power companies in central Texas are prepping for the worst. So we have hundreds of crews already from our Encore employees ready and prepped to go. They're making sure that they are trucks and all of the necessary preparations are ready. They're saying that there's going to be ice and there's going to be ice accumulating on the trees and trees fall into power lines. Conditions have prompted the cancellation of flights, holiday festivals and football games. And with sub-zero wind chill already hitting places like North Dakota and Colorado, it isn't only humans affected by the bitter cold. Below 20 degrees, they're locked inside um, for their safety. Lions at the Denver Zoo are weathering the storm indoors. We set up a lot of uh, toys for them to play with, different things for them to manipulate to keep them active and using their muscles. Um, we may set up something like TV for them to uh, give them something visual to interact with. They really do like the sounds of nature shows. Um, they might react to a hyena or a lion roaring. But not everyone is hibernating. In Minneapolis, people took advantage of the snow. It's perfect out. <laughs> the snow is, yeah, the snow is perfect. The National Weather Service says the cold temperatures will likely remain through late next week. Maggie Mazzetti, Associated Press.